Hi boys and girls, it's time for a picture story. And today we're reading The Very Busy Spider by Eric Carle. Ooh, look at the end papers. Oh, they almost look like, ooh, a colorful forest. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. And you know Eric Carl makes beautiful suns. But I do see something coming across the top. So here we go. Early one morning, the wind blew a spider across the field. A thin, silky thread trailed from her body. The spider landed on a fence post near a farmyard and began to spin a web with her silky thread. Nay, nay, said the horse, want to go for a ride? The spider didn't answer. She was very busy spinning her web. No, no, said the cow. Want to eat some grass? The spider didn't answer. She was very busy spinning her web. Bah, bah, bleated the sheep. Want to run in the meadow? The spider didn't answer. She was very busy spinning her web. Ma, ma, said the goat. Want to jump on some rocks? The spider didn't answer. She was very busy spinning her web. Wink, wink, grunted the pig. Want to roll in the mud? The spider didn't answer. She was very busy spinning her web. Woof, woof, barked the dog. Want to chase a cat? The spider didn't answer. She was very busy spinning her web. Meow, meow, cried the cat. Want to take a nap? The spider didn't answer. She was very busy spinning her web. called the duck. Want to go for a swim? The spider didn't answer. She had now finished her web. Cock-a-doodle-doo, cried the rooster. Want to catch a pesty fly? And the spider caught the fly in her web just like that. Who, who, asked the owl, who built this beautiful web? The spider didn't answer. She had fallen asleep. It had been a very very busy day. Do you see the spider? She's sound asleep up there. The end. Did you like that story? Yeah, it's good. Now, the next time you're able to go to a library, if you check out this book, 
on all of the pages, you can feel the spider web. Thank you, boys and girls. Bye.